quite like the term architect. So they, it's the you know it's the line managers, whether it's CE or whichever level, it's the line managers' accountability to you know it's a core cool part of their role, and you know there's a big culture shift required for this. It's a core cool part of a line manager's role to bring the next successes through, as Diana Crossan says, Rosemary, it's all about filling up the lift coming up behind you. Um, mm. <laughs> um, however, they can't do it without the architecture, mm. the systems, the approaches in place for them to identify talent, for the development to swing into action. Um, so working in, you know, it's that, so for the HR people, they need to absolutely understand the business. Um, at a you know both a strategic and an operational sense, and I think it's fair to say that sweeping generalisation, there's more of a tendency on the operational side of HR rather than mm -hmm. the strategic. Um, so the HR need to be understanding what the current capability is, what the future capabilities required for that business, um, and how to plan for that in partnership with the line line managers.